Well, shit. No one's going to listen to all this because I just went on a long rant. And as you can see, this video is about to be really long. But if you do, I owe you like a Baja Blast, like a Crunch Wrap, some cinnamon Pop Tarts. Dude, you're just a unit. Like, if you listen to all this, you're actually a unit. And I appreciate it because uh, times have been tough, man. I understand that some people don't like the fact that I have an ego, but just so we're very clear on why this is the case, I don't have anything, man. Everybody that I love is gone. Everything that I loved in life is gone, except for my own fucking achievements. So all I got left is my fucking ego. All I got left is my pride, and I'm not losing that shit. I'll die with that shit. All I got left is honor, which I actually fucking have. I don't fucking lie because I don't got time to lie. I literally do not have time to lie. It's a waste of my fucking time, and time is everything. People talking shit on me having an ego, it's like, of course I have a fucking ego. I'm all I fucking got. Everybody else that said they gave a shit, everybody's gone. Everybody left. Nobody's nobody stuck to their word. I'm the only one that sticks to my fucking word. I'm the only one that says shit and means it and does it. And why wouldn't I have an ego? I'm good at everything I wanted to be good at in life. Shouldn't I be proud of that? Shouldn't I be proud of the fact that I'm good at everything I set my mind to be good at? But the issue is I'm trying to explain a foreign concept to people that are in completely different stages of their life. And not only that, you guys don't understand what having an ego is. Like, an ego has a bad implication to it. I don't have an ego. There's a difference. There's a difference between being confident in yourself and talking about it openly and having an ego. Like, there's a fucking big difference. The, the biggest difference, the biggest way I can explain it, is anybody that talks to me on my Apex videos and they're like, hey man, how can I get better? I answer them with how I believe they can get better. And I've never treated a bad player, quote unquote, like they're bad. I've never done that shit. If I was better at the game than you, and that made me think I'm a better person than you, that would be having an ego. But if I'm just better at the game than you, and I say I'm better at the game than you, and I am better at the game than you, that's not having an ego, that's just a true statement. And I proved that. I mean, I hit Pred multiple times. I'm like That already puts me in a category, subcategory, that I'm better than most people. I can say I'm better than the average player. I can say I'm better than most players. I can say I'm better than 90% of the players. I can say I'm better than 95% of the players, because it's all true. It's just true. That's not having an ego. That's just a true statement, and I'm confident in myself. Also, even if I was only better than 90% of the players, I'd still say I'm better than 99% of the players, because I want some fucking confidence on my team. I want my team to go in thinking we're going to win. I want to always, like, there is no, we're going to lose. There is no, anybody's better than us. We're the best team in the fucking game. That's how you should be thinking when you play. If you want to win, go into the game thinking you're going to fucking win. You don't want to go in thinking you can't lose. That's a, there's a difference. Don't go in thinking you can't lose. But do go in thinking you're going to win. Like, I hate when I play with people and they're like, ah, at least we got second. What do you mean at least we got second? We fucking lost. Let's win. I came here to win. I didn't come here to get second. I didn't come here for KP. Quit talking about your fucking points. I don't give a fuck about your points. I came here to win. I came here to be the best. I don't give a fuck about points. Quit talking about your fucking points. Now I'm on a fucking heater. I'm mad right now. I'm on a fucking rant. Quit talking about your fucking points. That's that's another reason. You guys are fucking losing points because you all you care about is points. I care about winning. That's why I gain points. Because I care about winning. I play for the win. I don't play for points. I don't give a fuck about points. If I think I w if I want to fight somebody, I fight somebody. If I want to go kill a team, I go kill a team. If I've already got max fucking points, well, used to. Now, now it's different. But it used to, I used to have max points. I still fucking ran teams down. I don't give a fuck. I'm here to be the best. I'm not here for points. I don't give a fuck. I don't look at my points. You guys look at your points. You guys are like, ah, I don't know. If we just sit here and wait this wait this fight out, we might get we might get top ten placement. That's why you're not winning. It's because you're not thinking about the win. You're thinking about how... You're playing for points. You're playing to not lose points. You need to play to win. And I've said this... I've said it plenty of fucking times. If you want to be the best, I can help you get there. But you guys got to fucking take some of this shit into consideration and actually change your mindset into... Be, I, I swear, the most important thing you can do... I'm, I'm trying to give advice to, to some players. Like the, you know, There's people that ask me for advice. The best advice I can give you, genuinely, because if you want to get like tips and tricks for the game, I, I'm not going to give you tips and tricks for the game. And there's a few reasons for that. But I'm not going to do it. One reason is just because... Well, I'm not going to do it yet, at least. Um, one reason is just because if you want tics and tr tips and tricks for the game, there's plenty of people that make content like that, so you can just go watch them. Um, I don't want to rehash all this shit, because honestly, if you're a top-tier player, most people use the same tips and tricks, so it's just all the same shit, right? You're going to see the same shit over and over again. It's not going to help you that much. What I can help you with and what I can provide you that nobody else or very, very few people can provide you is I can provide you the mindset to win. If you want, If you want to learn how to be a winner, how to be a champion, you can listen to me and I'll help you out with that. 
I used to not be that good. I used to compete in COD, and I was not that good. I was the guy on the team that I was known as like the smart guy. I was I was known as the S and D star that just knew how to fucking play the game, knew how to like counteract plays and shit like that. I wasn't that good, and now look at me. Look how I changed. But a lot of that had to do with mindset. A lot of that has to do with the very confidence you guys talk shit on. It's like, wow, well you have a big ego, don't you? It's like, that's part of the reason that I'm good, because I think I'm that good. Like. If I ever get on the game and I feel like I'm not that good, I play like shit. But when I get on the game and I believe I'm one of the best players in the game, I am one of the best players in the game. And I'm not saying that that solely will get you there. Of course it won't. You do have to like back it up. You do have to be good. But you have to go into these games thinking you're going to win. You have to go in. You can't treat it like, oh, this guy's a pred. I don't stand a chance. Like, quit saying that shit. I've never said that shit. I've never looked at anybody's rank. I don't care about anybody's rank. It doesn't, it doesn't matter because I'm better than all of you. That's how I feel. That's how I feel. And some people are going to hate that statement and think it's egotistical, but it's not even about it being egotistical. It's about having confidence in yourself. Like, I don't ever look at somebody's rank and think, I can't beat that guy. Because there's no one I can't beat. If a pro was in my lobby, I wouldn't view it as, oh, there's a pro over there. I can't beat him. I can beat anybody. I don't care. Put them in front of me. Let's see what happens. you got to have the mindset to fucking win. But anyways, quit worrying about your fucking points, G. You guys gotta quit worrying about your points. I swear, like, worrying about your points is gonna make you lose more points than gain points. Trust me. Like, all these good, like, all the good players, like, all the Preds, like, people that are gaining points steadily, most of them don't care too much about their points, other than the fucking cheaters, the Zinners, the fucking, the glitchers, and all that dumb shit. Anybody that's truly good at the game doesn't care, doesn't care about their points because they just gain. They just gain. Like, me and my duo, every time we play ranked with a third, they're always like, oh, how many points do you guys have? Or, oh, but I, I don't have, like, they're, they're saying shit about their points, and we're just like, we don't care. If you play with us, you'll gain points. If you play with us, you listen to us, and you, like, you play with us, like, if you're, you know, with us on our plays, we're gonna gain points. You don't, you shouldn't have to worry about your points. If you're truly good, you don't have to worry about your points. You just play the game, and you win. Fuck. Uh, nobody nobody listened this far into it, because why would they? But, um... Yeah, sorry, man. I'm just... I have a lot of anger, and, uh... I mean, I don't know. I mean, I think I've already said it. I don't know. I probably deleted it anyways, but... Life has just been shit. Like, I lost everything I care about. I mean, the only thing left in life that I care about is me. So... I guess to sum it all up, if that's if you want to know why I have an ego, if you want to call it that, I'm calling it an ego because that's what other people are calling it. I don't necessarily agree with that because, like I said, ego has a bit of a bad connotation. But anyways, because and I don't view it as a bad thing. But anyways, if you want to know why I like think so highly of myself and why I talk my shit so much, it's because I'm all I got. So, it's sort of how it goes. Thanks for listening, even if you disagree. I mean, if you listened, you're just actually a fucking unit, bro. Appreciate it.